across the nation, a recent report shows a significant increase in grandparents caring for grandchildren. And those numbers are no different here in Pennsylvania. 2822 Sydney Costas has more from one organization that is trying to meet the needs we're seeing in NEPA. For many over the age of 65, retirement is the plan. But according to a recent report by the Census Bureau, raising a new generation is on the rise. We sat down with Frank Mariano, president of the Advocacy Fund for Grandparents Raising Grandchildren in Luzerne County, about the need their group is seeing. In Luzerne County, I think we're looking at about 2,400 kids being raised by about 1,000 um, grandparents or, or caregivers. The group made up of volunteers works with those looking to adopt the child in their care by providing support and funds through grants, money that many families in these positions are reliant on. There have been a number of parents who have been very, very concerned um, in their 60s or 70s who have um, adopted young children of how am I going to pay for their education? How am I going to take care of them when they get older? He says some reasons behind the grandparents stepping in can vary from parents struggling with addiction or abuse happening in the home, but it's not always grandparents coming to the rescue. My goddaughter uh, was in a horrible situation and I learned more in depth about her situation. I had decided it was time for her to come and stay with me forever. Catherine Faraday sought the help of the organization when adopting her daughter. She says its support group named the American Heroes is dear to her heart as they walked her through the process. It's a very tough battle, but it's also very rewarding. I I'm very thankful that I have custody and now have adopted my goddaughter. She's an amazing child and, and to watch her grow and guide her and give her knowledge of everything. It's just a wonderful situation. In Kingston, Sydney Costas, 2822 News. And the Advocacy Fund for Grandparents Raising Grandchildren's next support group is on May 13th at 6 p.m. at the Jewish Community Center in Kingston. At the meeting, you can find more information to donate or advice if you are looking to adopt.